Hey, what's up, y'all? Welcome back to the channel. Now, as you know, DMX got out of prison earlier this year, and he's been doing very well thus far, and people have been happy to see him thrive. I know I have been. He had the 20th anniversary tour for his Dark and Hell and It Is Hot. If you click on my channel, you'll see the video, the live footage. My son and I were in attendance. Man, that concert was the most livest, most realest experience I have ever experienced in my entire life. It was totally amazing. So excited for DMX, right? And then all of a sudden, he didn't go to the 35th anniversary for Def Jam. Oh my God, he's a no-show. What happened? Well, y'all, DMX put himself into rehab to get in front of the real issues with drugs. Because when we was at the concert, he was like, what y'all smoking on? What y'all smoking on? And people smoking bud and stuff. And he's like, I'm on probation. I can't smoke none of that. So I was totally shocked to hear that he was in rehab. But according to reports, he has had some serious family issues and the pressures of that and performing were pushing him to drugs again. Well, instead of doing that, he opted to get in front of it. He also did this for his family, which makes him a good dude. I mean, at least he's trying. I mean, I love DMX. We love DMX. We rooting for him. There are also some legal ramifications of drug use. He cannot get busted for anything of that nature. Or he is likely to go back to jail. DMX is almost 49 years old. And he got tired of being in prison, he said, y'all. He got tired of being in prison, even if the last time was for taxes, you know? We don't want to see him go back. Put in the comments what you think. Don't forget to thumbs up this video, like, comment, subscribe. We are changed for the better too, y'all. Peace.